Hello, I'm David Margaret, and welcome to the Actors' Lodge. Today's guest has been a gladiator and a Nazi. He's stolen from the rich to give to the poor, and also been a brilliant mathematician. He's best known, however, for his acting, with roles in films such as Gladiator, Romper Stomper, Robin Hood, and A Beautiful Mind, having earned him awards, acclaim, and the unquestioning devotion of myself and the children I've sired. His name is Russell Crowe, and he joins me now. Russell, nice to have you here. Hello, mate. How you doing? Very well, and gallant of you to ask. Now, we're here, of course, to discuss your enchanting career in the worlds of film, song and dance, but I'd be remiss if I didn't discuss the rumours that you were seen having dinner with Gina Reinhardt last night. Is that true? Well, you know, I think it's bad karma to actually discuss something like that. There were photos. There were paparazzos. Extremely annoying stalkers. You know, the, the paparazzi guys that, that will just, you know, ruin your life, ruin every quiet moment of your life um, if, they're, if they're allowed to. They're vultures, I agree. I prefer to admire actors from afar and any photos I take are for purely personal use. Back to this dinner, though. What did that meeting entail? The pictures seem to show Andrew Bolt was also present at the meeting. Is that correct? It's a presence, you know. Andrew Bolt's presence? Um... I'll take that as a yes, Mr. Crow. <laughs> now, what's Andrew like in person? Some say he's racist. You can see it in his walk and the way he stands and in his eyes, you know what I mean? Every Sunday morning on Channel 10. Now, I thought you were a Labour man. Aren't Andrew's views a touch conservative for your palate? He did once famously blame the Holocaust on the gays. You know, his passion for what he does is so infectious that you flow along with it. <laughs> That's how I feel about you, my liege. And uh, Gina, what did she have to say? How you doing, Rusty? You are right, Rusty? You are right, mate? Yeah. And after that? It doesn't matter who the Prime Minister is. An ominous proclamation. Cheers. There's rumours you were meeting with Gina and Andrew to discuss you playing him in the much feated biopic Andrew Bolt Koury Purge. Is that correct? You said that about my mum, or my sister, or my wife. Uh, I would be wanting to have a really seriously deep conversation with you, you know. And uh, I think there's just a lack of gallantry. Your anger is noted and my apology unreserved. But if you were to play Andrew in a film, what is it about him you believe you could best capture? Lack of gallantry. Of course. Now, in this photo you're talking while Andrew and Gina look on visibly confused. What were you discussing? Humanity, you know, and that's that's what interests me and that's what that's why I do it. That's why you do everything, I assume. Acting is your art, music your craft, and kindness your passion. Cheers. You know, Russell, you're very welcome. Now, sorry to return to this well, but if the offer was right, would you play Andrew Bolt on screen? I'll read a script. If it touches me, if I get goosebumps, then that's the role I have to do. That's the way you pay back the gods of film. Among whose members you count yourself. I definitely believe that. As do I. Now, we have a couple more paparazzo photos to look at here. They must have been, uh, must have been up late that night. Well, it was an odd meeting. In this photo, you and Andrew are curled up in Gina's lap, and it appears as if you're both breastfeeding. I mean, I haven't experienced that since I was a kid. My wife never ceased lactating post-pregnancy, so I'm in an altogether different boat. Back to this picture, however, the whole experience seems to have left Miss Reinhardt depleted and worn, as these pictures show you and Andrew being forced to carry her from the restaurant. It was one of the hardest jobs I've done for years. Uh, physically as demanding as Cinderella Man or Gladiator. Yes, fat jokes. And the photos end with you all entering her limousine and leaving together. Care to fill in the blanks for a curious observer? You know, I've been very lucky to actually find something as uh, significant for me. Russell, do you mean love? Have you, Andrew and Gina, all started a relationship together? Tweet that, you know. Um... With your permission, I will. If it's true, it's remarkable. Have you said that about my mum? Quite right, I withdraw. Well, uh, congratulations, I guess, on your little family. Cheers. Well, that's all we have time for today. Do you have any advice you'd like to pass on to aspiring young actors? I have two sons. One of them's an actor, for sure. Stirring stuff and a great note to end on. Russell Crowe, I thank you for your time. Oh, look, I got a pretty good bullshit meter, you know.
Um, you can tell a lot by a handshake. You can tell a lot by what's going on in somebody's eyes, you know? <laughs> Fuck off. <laughs>